The champs again. Big rematch in 2A state final where LCA took on Beachwood. The Tigers dominated the opening half with help from Mr. Football. Cam Hergott helped Beachwood jump out to a 20 point lead, but we know what this Eagles team can do. Just before halftime, LCA gets on the board. Drew Nevis to Parker Cheney. Big momentum swing here because LCA gets the ball at half and they march right down the field. Xavier Brown, Virginia commit, crashes in for six. That makes it 20 to 14 early in the third. The LCA defense stifling. Hergott now running for his life, and the ball pops out. It's a foot race to get it, and Tyler Morris scoops it and scores. Just like that, LCA leads 21 to 20. Fast forward to under two minutes left, same score. Jake Conrad barely has enough leg to hit a 36-yard field goal. But it's good. It's 23-21 with 1.45 remaining. 30 seconds left now. Fourth down and 12 for LCA. They bypass the 54-yard field goal and go for it all. Mason Moore had his man beat, but the ball is a little too far inside. And LCA has its season end with another heartbreaking loss. And let's go back out to Eli Gain at Kroger Field. Well, this game gives you two things, the thrill of victory or the agony of defeat. For Beachwood, they get to celebrate with a victory, and for the second straight year in the 2A state final, LCA is going through the agony of defeat in nearly identical fashion as a year ago. Had a chance to win it in the final minute, but it comes up short, and for the second straight year, the Eagles watch Beachwood celebrate on the opposite sideline. You know, I told our kids, you know, I love them. You know, that uh, it's easy to be when you're on top of the mountain. You know, it's easy to be all happy and smiles. But, you know, when you're in deep in the valley, sometimes you have to rely on your faith and your character. Looking back at the clock, just the same feeling as last year, you know. I just felt for my guys and the team next year who has to succumb this and come back to that. And the seniors who that's their last moments on the field, you know, looking at that clock winding down, nothing you can do about it. So these coaches just prepared us for this game as well as they could and uh, we just didn't execute couldn't make the plays we wanted to to finish off the game like we wanted to and then um you know almost the exact same feeling uh just that didn't go into overtime. So LCA finishes the year with a 14-1 record. As for Beachwood, they are the first high school football team in the state of Kentucky since 1994 to finish a season with a perfect 15-0 record. From Kroger Field, I'm Eli Gain, LEX 18 Sports.